Hey guys, so here bringing you another video. Welcome back to Clanton Master. We return Diamond to 79 LP after a three game win streak, which is really nice. Um, so bringing up the loading stats and yes, I am playing Silas because we've been again thinking about it for a while. And when I was looking at the enemy team, I was like, hey, there's a Malphite ult I can steal. There's a Malzahar ult I can steal. There's a Lulu ultimate I can steal. I was like, this is like the perfect game for me to try this. And again, I know you probably shouldn't when you're closing into Diamond 1 and there's going to be Diamond 1 people probably in this game. But why not? So, um, he's on a hot streak. I'm on a hot streak. He's auto-filled support main. Okay, so this is perfect for me. Doesn't do very well. Again, they're, they're obviously playing Malphite because they're not confident to play other things, which is fair enough. They're not a main of the role. Again, the, the bad thing is when a support main goes top and plays Yasuo or something stupid. Uh, this person waking up doesn't play any Sedge games. Again, within the last 30 days, remember. A lot of Malzahar games, and these two are duo. are going a very popular boosting lane is called Malulu. Our bot lane, that's a very good all-in lane versus those at level 6. Doesn't seem bad. You know, one game here, so nothing to go off. And again, Diamond 1, Shaco. So, we'll see how this game goes. Um, but yeah, I'm interested. I'm really interested to see what I can do, potentially, on this champion. Of all games for me to try it out, this is after arguably the best one. Because we're, we're against a support main in top lane, and there is... What? There are so many good things for to steal. He went teleport on Cogmore. Really? Yeah, that Zai is a smurf. No rank from last season. 74% win rate and is in Diamond 2. Yep. Kill Cog. Yep. So he can't... If he doesn't have flash up, I murder him in late game. Wow. Well, with my team. Yeah, I'm still going Aftershock. The only other thing that I would have even thought about doing, surprisingly, would be Electrocute this game. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah. I know some people do the Conqueror build, too. Again, I got a Red Bull. Sorry, everybody. It's like my first Red Bull. Oh, no, I had one at Comic-Con. I was about to say, I haven't had one for a week, but I had one at Comic-Con. I had a green Thai curry. And a Red Bull. It was really good. So I don't think this person's going to go AP because, again, um, generally AP Malphites will go Arcane Comet, obviously. Fanta Writer, thanks so much, dude. Welcome, 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 welcome. Okay, let's get that first blood, guys. Let's do it. Again, he's not got any heal or anything. Oh, it looks good. Hell's Lair. Hell's Lair? Sure, we'll say it. I speak it in Glando good. God, Silas is so obnoxious. <laughs> no, really? How did that happen? Oh, he teleported back instantly. Do you think that's why he goes teleport? Because he knows he's just going to die a bunch? I made a mistake here. Damn, I thought I would have enough damage. I wanted to take their jungler out. Damn it, man. No time to lick wounds. Always hit the ground run. That was so close. If I had a Doran's ring instead of a corrupting potion, I would have got that kill. That's the difference of the starting items. Okay. Again, I think we just want late game. He's got no sustain. 
What? Why would he buy a health? I don't know. Okay, we know they're a support main, but that's that should just be common sense. They should just aim for the Cogmore, dude. Just kill that dude every single time. Shaco make. Again, having Zyda flash there is whatever's, but... Yeah. Just kill the Cogmore. Kill him over and over and over and over and over again. Like, even if he's expecting to die a bunch... Um, you know, you're going to get partially tilted the more that happens. For sure. Kill the void dog. Yeah. Void doggo. Okay, he's gone. Maybe he's going to get sustain. It was really weird he came back to base with a ruby and no sustain. Pretty sure that's against Peter policy. Dude, Peter kills so many animals. You can't even cast him as an animal charity anymore. And I did hear that funny conspiracy about Peter. That, like, it's actually funded and made by people who are, like, big into the meat industry just to make, like, to make animal activists look crazy. Because Peter is, in general, crazy. So, yeah. It's probably not true, but it's a funny thing to think about. Damn. I didn't even get close. Oh, wait, he mucked up. <laughs> <laughs> he got out. Oh, sorry. That was probably really loud. It was just funny. Oh, man. God breeze. Such a much, dude. I don't even know what build I want to go, by the way. Like, am I going to just do the Ludens build? Or am I going to do the Proto build into Ludens? What is going on? She had heal. Tradition is a crutch for the I don't really know. Give me this. Give me this. Stand on my queue. Wait, what are you building? No. He can't be building Roa, can he? No. No. Abyssal Mask? Oh, maybe. Keep forgetting about that, I am. I hope he doesn't buy a roll, because, uh... Me. <laughs> he walked onto it again. Miles oh. Zahar's above me. I didn't want Malzahar to get anything. And I got a kill, so I'm happy. Shaker wasn't quick enough. Feels bad. How much does my ult do? I don't know. Yep, I'm happy with that situation. Malzahar wasted a lot of time coming for me and not getting anything, technically. And you have to remember, because they're trying to abuse the Teleport Cogmall, Mids is getting very little pressure, I'm getting no pressure. But we're still winning lane, kinda. And I think our advantage, as we've said earlier, our group should be relatively good. Auto. Not great, that. That was pretty messy. Oh 
Oh dear. There's a lot of mistakes happening this game, for sure. Is he coming top lane again? Silas so far. He's cool. Again, I know how to play him, so... It's just like getting the little things about him. Shouldn't be letting those happen for free, if we're honest. That's the closest Huzz will be playing Mal's this season. I don't know. I've played like three games of Mal's this season, um, but none of them recorded. Swine and sheep. That's all they are. I don't know why, but whenever I see the Cogmore Lulu lane and I know they're duo queue, it just it does put a little bit of a bad taste in my mouth. It's hard to explain. Oh my god, I was in tower the whole time. Ugh. That's what I like to see. Almost as bad as funneling. Well, it is a kind of funnel, but it is just a standard bot lane funnel. The idea is like you just buff the cog, a uh, cog more as much as you can, which I guess is fair enough. I don't know. I just, I just see it. I'm like, nah. <laughs> I had worse beatings in prison. Yeah, I didn't mean to put a second thing in W. That was an accident. Wait. Do I think that they're going to end the X-Men movies? Uh, well, they'll end them in their current iteration because they kind of have to. They shouldn't be fighting that. The enemy team is stronger right now. Mistakes. Again, so many mistakes. Basic, basic, basic mistakes. Look how quick this dude is. What the hell, Shaker? Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> he was so close to dying. <laughs> I don't know why my bot lane fought that though. Enemy team just coming back from basing. You haven't bought yet. You've just probably used most of your stuff to kill them. And then you fight them. Yeah, Lulu's saving uh, my Shaco. Thanks, Lulu. Thank you kindly. I like Silas, he feels smooth. What's his build? Components. Silas is the Kirby of League? Yeah. God, that fear didn't go off. They locked up a boy. But let loose the problem we have now is we actually don't want Cogmore to free farm, if we're honest. Oh, 
but I guess we kind of have to. I got the tower. There's nothing I can do. Our bot, my bot lane went for an aggressive play, by the way. It didn't kill him. Well, we, I desperately need help. They are going to keep coming. And my team is literally ignoring. Hello. This is what the enemy team wants right now. great for us. Again, they got top lane, but the enemy comp, in my opinion, is not about anything other than this Cogmore. Thank god. That Cassius damage wasn't bad. Are you serious? Oh my god, I missed... Oh, in the chat. I was panicked because of the stupid grump got in my way. Man. And again, like she's saying hello. Again, I wasn't saying hello to the cast when I was bot lane alone. It was more to the Shaco. That's who I want to come and help. Because with him, he can stealth behind the Cogmore and fear him. And then we can kill them pretty quick. So there's nothing even to like, I, her coming where she did, I was like, oh, Cass is coming. It wasn't directed at her. Why not take Lula? Well, it was on cooldown. You can't take people's ultimates all the time. It goes on a cooldown. <sighs> I wish she didn't die. Again, this Zaya does make a lot of mistakes. Oh god. This game's hard. I don't think we're going to win if the Zaya keeps doing what she's currently doing, by the way. Okay. Enemy team might. Oh my god, they all have flash. I died many deaths in my cell. Man, why did that have to be warded? Feels bad. I will show them a world without I need to go side lanes, but this is definitely a game that I'm not really trusting teammates. Which is an annoying thing. Again, it's fine. Ooh, Shaco needs to help the fiddle. They might be able to kill her. Oh, oh god! 
By the way, that was without Cassiopeia again, I think. The Cassiopeia is never with us. I don't know why. But yeah. But I, I don't mind dying if we win the fight. That's fine. Maybe I should have gone the tankier Silas build this game. Because again, the whole idea is just CC the Cogmore and we win. So maybe that's what I should have done. Oh my god. I'm not getting any side lanes. I want to go bot. Zaya wants to go bot. Please. Ow. <sighs> she's dead, the Cass, if she's not careful. Like, Cogmore's damage is broken. That's why you have to CC him. CC or burst. They honestly might. They are trying it. Got him. Oh, stupid little bug. I don't know how Shaco died. Whoever, wait, who was fighting back here? Was that Shaco? I think that was Shaco. Is Cass trolling? I, maybe. There is a possibility that she is. Side lane! <laughs> oh god, what am I team doing? Now they do Baron. Just, just, we need to stop risking stuff. I thought Shaco was going. He he looked like he was going, and then he backed out. The mage shall inherit. <sighs> To hope for a steal, I guess. Phil doesn't have ult. Oh god, he got hit. Just fear the guy. There we go. That that this Shaco is good. Again, I don't like Shaco as a champion, so for me to go, this guy's good, he's good. But my farm is just pathetic. Anytime you go side lane, you're like, well, now I've got a group. We actually could do it. Zai is basing, though. We could still do it. Cassiopeia is one of the fastest games in the, in, fastest champions in the game to do Baron. Oh, God. I got Malphite which is nice. Wait, Cogmore died? Why me? Wait, what? He cancelled it. What? She ha is she getting boosted? What's going on? I don't know why the double tanks, by the way, engaged like they did. Because they should just be about... <gasps> oh... <laughs> God damn. Shut down. Uh... 
<laughs> I'm going Merc Treads. I'm going Merc Treads. It's a fun game for sure, because it's quite on the line, because like this guy is everything, it's all their damage, and it's his bad positioning that is potentially leading them to die a lot. And it's just weird. <laughs> Ugh. But now we don't have anything for the cog. It's a fun game for sure, though. I just want farm. Me and me, Malphite and my farm hasn't changed. I think for about ten minutes. <sighs> I've got teleport now, though, so maybe I can side lane a little bit. Maybe I can get like ten farm. And uh, that would be great. Woo. Imagine that, guys. Ten farm. Okay, I can nearly ult the Malphite. That's pretty much the one that I want to ult. I think every time. My team hopefully don't do anything crazy because Fiddles, Barton, Zaya's not in mid. I'm not there. Okay, we got some side lane. What a weird game. I want to stay near my Zyre as well, because she's like our big carry. That Sedge cannot make up her mind. God. That Zyre actually ripped her a new one. I want the Malphite ult. Oh, you killed yourself. Wait, Fiddle, where are you? took a long time. You've got the whole world in his hand. You've got the whole <laughs> Guess we just back out. Like, I got Malphite ult now. That's what I was looking for. I think we got two towers in the end. Mm. She got the root. Oh, look at that Cogmore damage. It's crazy. Guess we're back. Korg has no flash. Oh my god, he's free. He's free. How do they know where I am? Calm down. I'm literally just a utility bot at this point. I'm I'm basically Malphite, but I'm a oh I lost his ult. Feels bad. I don't have his ult anymore. We need well we've got Infernal up in a minute, so maybe we don't need to risk anything. I don't like this. This is way too risky for me. God, even Zaya's damage isn't bad, too. Ooh, I'm getting cold. Why am I getting cold? They just went boom. This might be fine. 
Yeah, it's fine. Again, they keep using stuff on me when I'm not the carry. <laughs> like, okay. Use Malzahar ult on a Silas when there's a, these two you need to stop. Okay. <laughs> it's depressing for me, but we win the game, so whatever. Alright, we're gonna get the top tower as well, because Cass is... Cass's playstyle is quite weird, but she keeps going to side lanes as a Cassiopeia. Alright, inhib. Yeah, I know that, that's like, what, the third big fight without a Cassiopeia? Something like that. And he's doing Inferno. Mm. Can we get the front door? Oh yeah, let's just go do Baron. No shame in getting carried. Well, it's a weird type of carry because, like... The enemy, in a weird way, are carrying themselves for us to win, if that makes sense. Because they keep making the wrong decision to focus a Silas. I've been Sedge ult. I've been Sedge ulted. I've been Malzahar ulted. Like, sure, keep focusing me. So it's weird. If they didn't focus me and focus, like, our proper carries... Uh, they would probably come out a lot more on top. We should probably just go mid. Hmm. <laughs> Guys like my farm score, man. Boosh. Look how impressive it is. It's crazy, right? Why oh, Lichbane over Zonya? Because I want the enemy team to focus me. If I go Zonya, it might put them off doing stuff to me. I've just embraced what I am in this game. I am the target. Made a mistake. Oh wait, no, I didn't. Now's our ultimate meet again. Uh, I'll take it. I'll take it. Wow. Still no Cassiopeia. <laughs> Oh, so weird. Can she get this? Yeah. Can she get that? Yeah. Weird place though. It's fine though. Again, we're getting a bunch of damage on that too. Okay. That's fine. I had worse beatings in prison. Hmm. So again, Malphite's farm and my farm hasn't moved. His farm, I think, in the last 15 minutes has moved 20, and my's, mine's moved about 20 as well. Just sometimes again, games are weird. Again, that's why when people ask me what's the better, what's the best farm score at 10 minutes, there's not really an answer because every game is different. Obviously, there's something you want to try and aim for, but this game, as you can clearly see, isn't. It's not that type of game. It's it's a game that is kind of weird and we've just got to get on with what we can do because if i side lane my team gets caught because it's, it's a pretty close game the game's over i'd rather just spend it being with my team and potentially like dealing with the cogma or whatever more or less being frontline ap silas as weird as that sounds that's basically what i am shaco could backdoor yeah but backdoor is risky he might go for it, but they might be waiting for him. If we don't have vision of all five of them there, there's no point doing it.
legit, I'm just a malfight this game. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, we win though. Hey. We did it. And I get 50 gold. I I'm happy with that game. It's not a carry position, but that means we continue our win streak. And we did our job. And yeah, maybe Tank Silas would have been more useful this game because that's what we turned into. But we were still doing damage to the Cogmore with a Malphite on and that type of thing. Uh, I'll give it to the Shaco. I think without the Shaco, this game would have been a lot more difficult than what it was. We only gained 16, but it really doesn't matter because we weren't going to get in promo anyway. So we're now on 95. We go 5, 9, 11, 137 with damage done, dealing basically no damage. Again, more than Fiddle, which is a bit surprising. But yeah, more than, again, my lane opponent, direct lane opponent, we do more than him. We do more than the Sedge. So it's okay again it was really weird that i was getting focused as much as i was because that definitely enabled a Zaya to carry and a shako to go assassinate a cogmore because like Mal malzahar ultimate if you look at the our team uh notice uh, she did get qss but did shako get Q no qss on shako or anything like that so it's like you, you mal maybe malzahar could have stopped people but yeah, that's going to be it. If you guys enjoyed this really weird game, um, throw a like on the video. Again, I am considering picking up Silas. And, you know, it was a weird game, but I was useful. Um, imagine a game that I actually do well. That would be great. Um, but yeah, throw a like, throw a subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.